step in making these wing A plugs is chamfering both ends. That way I can cut a plug off each end. Of course, I've already ripped and surface planed each of these sticks to exactly the right size. With so many sticks, I can cut a big batch of plugs each time. Notice that I stopped the saw completely before removing the plugs, otherwise they could get caught in the blade and BAM! Scare me to death and they'd get chewed up too. This is a very cool tote bag from Calvera. It's got a drawstring on the top so stuff won't fall out. It's got a belt clip on the side and it has a carabiner on it so you can hook it on a ladder. I like using a fixture or a jig on my miter saw whenever I cut really small pieces like this. I lock the fixture down so it won't slide, which makes cutting small pieces much safer and a lot more precise. All you have to do is drop the clamp down on the jig and then lock the lever. I always use a template guide so I won't ruin my template while I'm cutting mortises for the pegs. I put a little bit of glue on the back of the peg. Now all I gotta do is 182 more.